So this is the Cisco Cetus, and as you can see, here it is outside of the dock, and this is the device when it's fully docked in its media station. And as you can see, when it's docked in its media station, it has the appearance of a traditional tele telephony device, and even common features like a message waiting indicator. You can see we got a, a, a message waiting indicator in our inbox there, or our message box, and then I can even see a little notification of that here, right there, new voicemail message for David Scott. So um, this is we're looking here at our unified inbox, which can correlate uh, different events to an individual. So here I can see Randy. I can see all the emails associated with, uh, with him. I can see the calls that he sent me and any calendar events that are associated uh, with him. And then I can also uh, you know, just tap his face to, to jump into different uh, kind of multimodal functions, right? I can go into um, uh, make a phone call, I can go into contacts, I can go into WebEx. So we'll look at the contacts here and you can see I have various different uh, you know, methods to contact him. I can send him an email, I can chat with him, uh, I've got different options, I can call, email, chat, I can see his present status. Uh, on the left here are speed dials, so I can do a speed dial to my favorite telepresence rooms, and I can uh, go to my history list and pull up all of my you know, recent uh, messages from different people, I can even look at my voicemail, visual voicemail, so I can go ahead and play a visual voicemail. Got our sounds down. So you get the idea. And then I can look at all my contacts here. And this is synchronized with Exchange. So this, this all my contacts within my organization. I can of course favorite somebody if I wanted to do that. I could simply I'll just add Kara as a favorite. And we'll just add her to favorites, and so I can put her on my exclusive buddy list, if you will. So returning back to the home screen, we can actually see the unified inbox, which we were looking at just a moment ago, and it basically correlates uh, user activity, such as uh, you, can, you know Randy left me a voice message, so he pops to the front, right? So. Uh, different messages as they come in will show different people within the organization, which is kind of a neat feature. And then I can see how many uh, voice messages I have. Uh, the App HQ, which we were looking at uh, earlier, as you can see, this is the App HQ. These are basically ways for uh, an IT. Uh, to IT to provision applications in the cloud, so you can either provision applications in the cloud or you can provision them on premise. So you've got some flexibility there in how you want to provision. Uh, and of course, we have the Android Marketplace. Uh, we can we can definitely uh, take full advantage of the Android Marketplace with however many hundreds of thousands of apps are available for the Android Marketplace.